Okay, welcome back to The Walking Dead, and let's see if we can conclude this episode with this video. Damn it. Again, guys, I really hate having to let y'all view it like this. But again, piece of shit dazzle that doesn't like to work. And I have tried getting it to work, but it don't. It just don't want to work. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? This should be the Let's last time we go outside. Around. Okay. <clears throat> so, let's try to finish this. I'm going to break that rock. I got an idea. <clears throat> All right, breaky, breaky. Get out there. Let's get those keys. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Takes care of another zombie. God. Gotta do it, man. There we go. Holy crap! Run! Now. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Yeah. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Left for Dead? Oh, this happens in Left for Dead too. 
well, first one and second one. But you're attracting some attention now. I wonder if this one is significant. Because they're really focusing on this one. I made it out of that mess in one piece. Well, most of us did. Sorry, Doug. Damn. 
So, Glenn, how you doing? Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. You be safe. You be safe too, Glenn. Though we know you're going to be safe for the most part. Glenn's one of my, I'll be honest. Glenn is one of my favorite characters on the show. Him and Daryl. Some really great characters. See you, Glenn. Look forward to seeing you in, in the rest of season three. Unlike T Dog. T Dog! <laughs> hey, kid. I liked him! Close call. Why did he have to die? Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. What a Carl! Hey, about Clementine. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Carl's gonna Earlier, give her his baby I said sister. There's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. But seriously, Carl, I still blame you for Dale's death in season two. Don't think I haven't forgotten about that. Okay, you know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met, and he was such a... It's just that I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Give me some time to Wait, cool off. Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I didn't. Ah. Sometimes we don't make choices. We just do what we do. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. That's one of the things of a zombie apocalypse, man. Can't save everyone. Stop staring at me, asshole. Super dinosaur was toast. Seriously, I hate that guy, Larry. Oh, and then. And it sucks because I got a next door neighbor named Larry, and I like him a lot. Okay, sorry. I'm sorry. There's uh, not a lot of kids here. <laughs> no, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Aww. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. Aww. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. <sighs> Let me go deal with this. What do you oh, want, man. asshole? Clementine, another thing. <laughs> what do you want? You like my daughter? <laughs> yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. 
I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? Fuck off. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. <coughs> Me too. This motor is pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, yep. you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. The question is, how much longer is that light going to last? Well, shit. There goes the power. Generators, generators and power plants don't last long. So that's pretty much it for the first episode. Watch this quick preview and then we're gonna call it a video. We'll be fine if we survive the walkers. Never expected they'd stop us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. Walkers don't worry about as much as the babies. That's the end of episode one, but I'm gonna try to record episode two before I have to take this thing back and ah, uh, you and 84 percent of players were honest. You and 74 chose Sean. You and 50 percent defended Kenny. Nice, nice. You and 48 percent of players refused the gun. You and 65 percent of players chose Carly. I wonder what I wonder what happens if we decided to choose Doug. I'm gonna have to find that out for myself. So guys, that's episode one, and I'm gonna try to record episode two before I have to take this game back to the to family video. And I well, I definitely will do episode two, but I'm gonna try my hardest to try to get episode three as well. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this, and I'll see y'all next time. Don't miss it.